at this point, I, it, so this is the most prepared you're, you think you're willing to be without... Cheating. Yeah. <laughs> we'll give this a shot. Hi, everyone. Welcome back to Player Guides. I'm Hannah. I'm Cameron. I'm Nate. And we just got, well, I just got my ass kicked by Ultra Necrozma or Don No, we Necrozma. got our asses kicked, Hannah. We're, we're a team. Um, we're a team. And we needed to switch our controllers for the wormhole travel situation. So we came into this office building to do that. And yep. we switched up the party to try to be better or at least beat Necrozma because we're not able to catch it. We finally used all the rare candy we were hoarding. So yep. we have so Creepachu Doug is a Creepachu. boss now. Um, yeah, we leveled up Creepachu with the rare candy. Mm -hmm. Bowser, Pigwidgeon, Houdini, and Heimlich. Uh, do you actually want to switch Creepachu to the first place spot? Yeah, that's probably a good idea. Um, we, we figured... Um, <laughs> what are you doing? Oh. Ignoring that. What building are we in? This is like the, you know how in every Pokemon game, Game Freak has a secret office building cameo? This yeah. is that building in Alola. I was going to say, this looks like way different than anything else we've seen so far. So if we, we, we never actually, oh, I don't think we Oh, got the Game Freak insignia this. on the front yeah. of the fucking thing. That's cool. I like that. So if we leave the building, we can fly back to Pony Island um, to head back through the wormhole. Hopefully we can control it better now with... Uh, Sol Galea with the circle pad. Yeah. Because we talked to that helmeted guy and he let us switch the controls. So we figured that out. Mm -hmm. um, so if we have controls for the wormholes, then do you guys want to go through the other wormholes and see what that gets us? Yes. Or do you guys want to go do no, round two? No, I think it would be good to go to the other wormholes and see what gets us. Okay. You just said that that... Okay. He, so, wa he wants to do it, Hannah. I think the he only way to... Shame. That wasn't the... <laughs> the only way to control the map is via the um, yeah, mouse, the, I think. Yeah. Okay. All right, so talk to Captain Vicodin yeah. over there, whatever his name is. And our, our, our logic behind using Creepachu is that we are pretty sure... That um, it is Dragon, because he, sh he shot a bunch of Dragon stuff at us. Yep, and that's what fucked up Arcanine. And, he, and he's, he, didn't he use Psychic on us, too? So oh, it oh, took us right there. We don't have... An option to go through the other wormholes. Once we found the white wormhole, that's it. Oh, right. so much for those other Pokemon. Well, just, I am I we right? Were, we weren't going to use them anyway. We just wanted to see what yeah. else there was. And we'll probably have access to the minigame once we beat this guy. Yeah. Plus, but, this is about what we were going to do anyway. So, this no, is fine. Hannah, I don't think anything we caught right now would be stronger than the party we've trained up. Yeah. Um, but yeah, so we think that Necrozma is at least psychic type. It probably is Dragon, but it's definitely using Dragon-type moves, so we figure Creepachu is a strong first-position Pokemon yeah, against that. I'm pretty if, sure it's Dragon Psychic. Yeah, because yeah. Uh, Ghost would counteract Psychic pretty well, and yep. Fairy would counteract Dragon pretty Entirely, well. Entirely, yeah. Dragon-type moves won't affect We at least get one shot on this anyway, so... Yep. Seems there like Creepachu is the way to lead off. Do we want to... Wait. Oh, shit. What? I was going to say, do we want to give Creepachu, like... We don't have the fairy move, but do we have? We could use a, give him a ghost move or like a ghost ghost any MZ. Or... I think he has one. Does he we have didn't one? actually check to see does. what he was equipped with. Either way, I was gonna say if we get a free one on it, we could at least soup him up. But it doesn't matter. Let's yeah. just do it. I, I think it's too All right, round, round two, two motherfuckers. To get it. our possible asses kicked because mm -hmm. Cameron and Nate hindsight is twenty twenty. Oh, completely. Well, you also were running up to him really fast. Come yeah. on, it's fine. So, we, he pulls his aura off. He's, got, yeah, that. he's going triple KO Ken on us right now. It's probably the equivalent of a totem aura. There's yeah. our Creepachu. First hit doesn't matter. Yeah, so, let's, so let's see go. what our options are. Uh, what's his Z move? I think it's Ghost. Is it Ghost? Yep. All right, let's hit him with that. Because that'll fry his... If he's Psychic type, it'll fry his Psychic Now, typing. here it is an option. Is that Z move um, physical or special? I'd... Hit L and A. Physical. Power 140. We and, and this is me theorizing, so don't think that I'm ordering you to do this. But we have a move called Hone Claws, which raises our attack stat. If we know we get a free move off, is it worth it to use Hone Claws, raise our attack stat, and then use the Z move I, on the next turn? Or is that too I risky? I don't think we're going to live through an actual hit. 
He's like, this guy is still ahead of us, and he's got his Kaoken going. I mean, he's pretty much destroyed our last thing. I wouldn't want to miss a chance to do some damage now. Because the Z-Power will pretty much pump us up pretty well as it is. I mean, I get your strategy. I just don't know if we would be able to, like, tough out one more shot with beyond our freebie. Anna, what do you think? Let's try the Z-Power. Okay. Let's just try that move and see what happens. She likes my strategy yeah. better. He's, well, Necrozma's going to be faster either way. Probably, We yeah. think so. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, smart Strike. Smart Strike, so... So this is That's either going to kill us, or it's just no, going to do that. Get I get one. the disguise, I get that, but you still never know. Well, what do you no, mean? It, you never, never it will never hurt us the yeah, first time. Yeah, that's the whole point of the disguise move. Let's see what we got here. Hopefully this does... I get that does... the sun rises every morning, but you know, you never know about these things. Well, not in this world, actually. I'm... Yeah, that's true. Necrozma specifically. I was going to say. I'm going to bald happy. Necrozma's like, this can't hurt me. My life's already a never-ending nightmare. <laughs> I'm so edgy. Okay, that was decent. <laughs> Although, you know, if we go to a round three, the other option would be... And then feint attack would probably be... Or, no, no, no. Well, I guess at this point, home claws would be... Shadow claw or play rough because we oh, get the right. stab. Yeah. Which one's the stronger move? But too late. Doesn't matter. <laughs> well, that's why I'm checking yeah. these things. Let's find out. Yeah, so we would definitely wouldn't have survived if we choose the home claw. Oh, well, that was a crit. Yeah, that so that might have been some bad luck on our part. Alright, so now then. Houdini has dragon type moves. Yep. Decid Pig Widget has ghost type moves. Yep. Um, and Widgen's he might be able to take I a wonder if Pig Widget's Z move would have been stronger that than Creepy Juice my... because it's yeah. ghost. That's Yeah, that's another also. option we can take if we yeah. have to go to a round three. So let's try Pig then to see if he can even take a, hot, a shot. Yeah, it'll So that way if we fuck up again. Yeah. If we fuck up again, then we know... And if we can take a shot, we could roost afterwards. Maybe. Maybe, so. maybe, maybe. Alright, so let's... Yeah, Spirit Shackle. Okay, this so he's gonna, faster. He's is, always going to be faster. He's always going to be faster. This is... Yeah. Oh. This is a repeat of last time. Yeah. That's rough. Yeah. He's just so fast. Yeah. Right. Alright. So Houdini's probably our next best shot. Because he's got dragon moves. Yeah. Uh, this is probably just going to be the same thing as always. So this might be the thing where we... Although his Intimidate might help out. I don't really know. Yeah. Uh, dragon, dragon Tail. Uh, I guess Dragon, dragon Tail, yeah. I thought, is the one that... Okay. It doesn't matter. Well, because it probably it's won't... It's super effective. No, this is... It's all going to be one and done with all of these guys. Yeah, it usually is. It's oh. going to be one and done. Because we, well, we kind of don't have the firepower. Creeper 2 was kind of our best shot. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, yeah. it's whatever. Yeah, the Bowser rest might of have a high speed died before. Yeah. yeah. Maybe I think our best, our mo only hope now is that he uses a less effective move on accident. Yeah, I don't know if point. the AI. I don't is think that's gonna work. Uh, outrage. outrage. I don't. Okay, that's not gonna do anything. That boosts yeah, us no. up. No, it doesn't. It like it, it commits us to a five uh, attack. Yeah, which a we. Five, it doesn't matter because we're gonna. Yeah. It's too I know. Fast I'm just a little irritated, and I'm, we couldn't. Tell. I shouldn't. Be, it's a but puzzle you have to solve, right? The next. So we. we I can... had my theories, and now we can't do it. Well, because what's your theory? We did it better. No, my theory was right. If we had been able to, I still think if we had been able to go to the other wormholes, we could have used some of those Pokemon to help us fight this guy. They would have been higher. They would have been higher levels, but I don't know if they'd been a, a complementary type. Better of. stats. Well, we don't know what's there, so. Yeah. Right, but now knows. now we can't until we beat him. I mean, maybe if we talk to the other Ultra Knot or whatever, Recon Squad person, maybe they have, like, you know, talk oh. to him for, to go straight there, talk to that one to the minigame again, yeah. who knows. The other thing we missed, we forgot, was Roto Boost. Oh, yeah, we did forget about that, didn't we? We could try and boost our stats before the fight. Yeah. I was gonna say because we also could give a focus sash to pig, except that that takes away our ability to do a Z move. Oh, do we give a focus sash to Creepachu so it lives t through two hits? Possibly, possibly. And then we don't have to worry about a Z move there. Although, we just good luck. Good. I mean, Heimlich being a champ here. Yeah. Tough thank you, Heimlich. At least we. I mean, we did better than we did last time. We got yeah. about halfway down. This is an improvement. Yeah. 
Power gem. Come on, Heimlich. Let's come on, Heimie, one no, more time. No. no. Sorry, buddy. Good. Okay, nice so job. what did we learn now? We learned that we're we're right about Necrozma's typing. Yep. Thing. Pretty sure. At least the dragon part is for sure. And I'm losing money, which I'm also not happy about. Well, but we're rich as hell. Yeah, plus there's care. a bunch of items that we can like... It's the principle of the game. I, at this point, I, it, so this is the most prepared you're, you think you're willing to be without... Cheating. Yeah. <laughs> we'll give this a shot. Decidui died to a crit last time, so maybe well, if our... Presumably. Yeah, maybe if our strat... Because it's only five levels lower than... Not Necrozma. even. Oh, or is it? Yeah. But it's also five levels lower, and uh, it's got the, like, aura thing going on as well. So it might as well be, like, ten levels or whatever the equivalent is. So we'll go through the wormhole. We'll get up to Necrozma. Before you do anything, save. Mm -hmm. I will. And we'll use a roto boost. Talk to what's her name? The girl, not not the, not the dude. Maybe Lily? she gives you a different one. Yeah, that one. Solely not. No. <laughs> I. All right. Whatever. We don't know. Just a thought. I don't think I can talk to her. Okay. I. Okay. Yeah, I think you're right. They come as a pair. Yeah. Right now. Let's do this. We got this. Is there anyone Round else three. I should talk to before I go? I... You think? Unless you want to talk I to the rest know. of the crew that's here. It's up to you. <sighs> All right then. <sighs> let's. What about this fucker? Give. Let him borrow it. Let, let's borrow that guy. <laughs> Soul going. Yeah, up, yeah. Seriously. Okay. Fucking shit. Go to the top of the tower. Just don't talk to Necrozma yet. Yeah. I mean, Necrozma's a pretty good sport about this. He's like, all right, just let me know when you're ready. Yeah. Start it's first. interesting that they say he's like... Don't he's, want to pull a hammy over. He's got all the light that of his old power, but he can't seem to control it. He seems to be doing yeah, just fine. Yeah, he's a pretty fine. patient dude. All right, Megalo Tower. Okay, at this point, once we get to the top of these stairs, I will save, don't worry. more windy than I thought. I will save. Yeah, they kind of go on longer than I thought. Seriously, it's there it kind is. of showing off now. I'm going to save. All right. Yeah, that was a good time. <sighs> and right. now, uh, All right, so creepy go into your bag. Soy focus, soy bag thing, whatever. The f what the fuck is it? Uh, go focus left dash. two into your roto boost stuff. Oh, yeah, roto boost. Roto yeah. boost R and raises then... all the stats of your battling Pokemon. Cool. Yeah, definitely. Oh, it's a use item. Oh, fuck me. Okay, that's not worth it then. Well, it might be worth it to use Creepachu's first hit to raise everyone else's stats, right? Maybe? That doesn't make sense. I don't know what you're talking about. Well, the okay. pro problem so this, is that no one else will live through what, it long enough. What is confusing you? What you literally just said. Roto Boost is an item. Right. It, it raises, raises all the all stats, stats of the battling Pokemon, but yes. I can only give it to... I have to choose the Pokemon to give it to. Yeah, I so, think it only works on one Pokemon. Right. Give to Pokemon. If I give it to Piggy, he's holding a Z move. Is it... I, I'm. What I'm so, saying is I don't know if it's a hold item or a use item. Like, in battle, we use it. It looks like the it's... the other items, like hit Roto Stealth. It looks like it's a hold item. Roto boost. Let's find out. Um, it is a... I think it says it's a used in battle. Yeah. Yeah, used in battle. This item will increase each of your active Pokemon stats by one stage. Yep. Did I decrease my Pokemon, or did I just decrease my chances of catching wild Pokemon? I don't know. What did... What I did... hit fucking Roto Stealth. Then, yeah, probably. So if I decrease my Pokemon levels... Is that what... You didn't decrease Pokemon levels. You just decreased the chances of running into a wild okay, Pokemon. Okay, I don't care like about running into... A, okay, that's what I wanted to confirm. Yeah. I don't care if I decrease my level of running into a wild Pokemon, <laughs> but if it affected my actual Pokemon, I'm going to be pissed. No, I Why would fine. it do that? I, I don't know why are there fairy Pokemon. <laughs> you still Questions on that. that can only be... Right? <laughs> why did... We don't know the answer to we were hoping to Why is an entire economy based on pit fighting? Yeah. I don't know. We're, why? We were hoping to get in like six episodes today, but Hannah's at the end of her rope. She's going to put All you right. at the end of a rope. Let's do this. And by that, I mean she's going to What else do we need to do? What? <laughs> Say it now or forever hold your goddamn peace. <laughs> so I was just going to suggest a battle strategy. You don't have to follow it. But we know that Creepachu is going to get two... Two hits in. Hits in. Minimal. 
do we bother using the first hit to do the whole stat increase? Maybe that stat increase raises his health and defense enough that he survives more hits. I don't think he will. Okay, that's the only thing I was yeah, thinking. I'm going to say try and hit play rough twice. Who has happens. play rough? Creepy Chew does. Thank you. You're welcome. Should be your, it should be your leadoff batter. All right. You should be able to get two hits off. We'll see if it <sighs> equates to one Z move. She's determined. Well, we'll see. <laughs> you know what you haven't done? I mean, you're getting angry and whatever, and that's fine. But you haven't done the thing where you like kind of start losing and then you throw the whole game away. Which I'm proud of you for that. Yep. Like where you, you hit the smallest roadblock and then you, you get yeah. really stressed out about it. It's almost it. like that your own stats happened. are increasing, Hannah. Yeah. Good for you. Hannah, you've leveled up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so let's do play rough. Do we before we use it? Do we yeah. want to check it to see that that is the move we want to? That's use? That's true. Between the ghost move and the, oh, I guess we're gonna. Do I it. I tried. Whatever. I tried. I hit You're both. I fine. hit both fucking buttons, guys. It's, o- it's okay. We're not accusing you. It's fine. Yeah, it happens. Relax. Okay, so there's our first right, so hit. That's our first hit. Neck and then broken. We should get another. We're okay. All right, play, play rough. rough. Let's see what that does. We're still at full health, so the focus sash. That still did comes jack in. shit. Well, we didn't know that. Yeah, that's right, why let's we tried again. Let's let's do. All right, let's go to your fight, and we get one more free one. So we know play rough does that, but what's shadow? Let's look at the stats of Shadow Claw. Let's tr- let's. All right, that's a seventy move. That's a seventy yep. percent damage. Critical hits land more easily. And All what right. was play rough? And play rough was a ninety, 90 move. So it's the better of the two. It may I'm... also lower the target's attack stat, which would be nice. And so. then uh, faint attack. Well, if it's a dark move. I don't think dark is going to do anything. Yeah. Well, it it will because it's psychic. But yeah, yeah. yeah but so it's play not the rough is move. still the best, best move. move. So let's just do play let's rough do it again, again then. Yeah. Yep. Because who knows? Maybe we'll lower his attack stat. Oh. All right. Photon this, guys. This should kill us all down to one percent. Yep. Okay. So there's that. So it's working its magic here. There's the focus sash. Mm-hmm. Oh, Avoided God. the attack. <laughs> okay. Gotta love that 90% um, accuracy. Okay. We have a turn here. What is that positive thing above his head on the... Th- on the... It's his stats. I mean, if oh, you want, his, we can try... If you want, we can try okay. to heal. It won't matter. And see if... He'll Creepa one-shot us. Shoe can still hold on for 1% longer, no, even after healing. I don't think it'll work, because the only reason why we aren't dead now is because of the... Uh, the focus sash. Yeah, we could dig into our bag and see if there's anything else we could use on someone else. Yeah, like Piggy probably would be our best bet after this. But I don't think there's anything. Do we have like an X attack or an X something? Again, I really wish there was some sort of like move or something that I could use to make Piggy faster. That's ultimately with all of my Pokemon, there... whoever I switch in, I, I there's got to be something that I have or something we can collect that would make them go I, first no matter what. Well, I don't know about going first no matter what, but uh, there are items that do that called like X attack, X defend, X speed or whatever for the and it's a temporary thing, but for the fight they are like roided up for Yeah. I don't know if we have any in our bag, but we can probably go hunt those down. I don't somewhere. think we do, but that's what we need. Yeah. I mean, they're probably Oh, no. No, right we there. do. All right. Let's see. Oh my god. Let's but, see. But there's not one for speed. Yeah, but defense and defense, special, special attack, attack, special defense, adrenaline orb. That's got to be something. Well, that's, probably no, that, hold, that's probably a holdable item. The adrenaline orb, if you don't you don't remember, but what adrenaline orb was is an item you can use on a wild Pokemon to help it call for help faster. It's oh, how we chain right. together for Gumi. Yeah. Okay. Well, if that's the case, do we want to try and just pump Piggy up and put all everybody else up for sacrifices? Because that's I want to see something I got. I want to see if I want to see right. if this will work. Sure. Uh, that will be a full I, heal. I know. Oh, Do you want to use a max potion sake. instead? Whatever, doesn't matter. We did save right before this, so we yeah. can just reset. we can just restart in case I, anything goes to shit. I just want to see. I just want to see okay. what what happens. It's either going to be a one and done, or a creepy will, will survive oh. and hold on because we've buffed him up. Well, we haven't buffed him up. Oh! Oh! Yeah. Hannah but... was right, just for a little bit, just for a little bit. Hannah was right. Well, no, I'll yeah, take we it. Have to... Yeah. Well, they, we'll see what Hannah does next. Okay. We'll, we'll sit back a little further on this one. We believe in you. All right. Show us what's up. 
So. This will kill me. <laughs> yep. <laughs> All right. So, who's next? I'm thinking we have four opportunities to buff up Piggy. Well, I don't know if I don't know if I want to use Piggy used. right now. Items. I don't think the X attack and stuff can be used on the Pokemon that is in your party. It has to be used on the battle. On the, one. On the battle, and it one. takes a turn. Yeah, it does. That's do why that. they're not that great. I've never used them like ever in the history of my Pokemon career, so I I don't know. <laughs> the the best option you have, I think, is sending Pigwidgeon out, mm -hmm. using your Z move, and hoping he doesn't die to a crypt. Yeah, but. Okay, I'm gonna send him out, and Necrozma's gonna go first, and Pigwidgeon is. It's gonna be a one. And the, done. Okay, well, the only so, thing, the only debatable thing here is that did he die last time from a critical hit, or did he die because yeah. it's just outright gonna kill him? No in what. this discussion, it's important for me that you understand this. Is anyone else not going to get one shot? Yeah, literally everybody else is because no one is as high as he is, and we've literally tested this before, twice now. Everyone dies in one shot. We're not saying this will win and you the game. Heimlich is actually, but this is the only unknown unknown variable right Heimlich here. Heimlich is actually leveled up more than Pigwidgeon is. Yes. I recognize that Heimlich is not as effective. Yeah. But in regards with All levels, right. Heimlich is the highest. Yeah. And Heimlich has a history of toughing it out. All right. So that was uh, a wasted turn. Well, it's what, no what different than what we would have would wasted have for done? other ways. Oh. What? Support you can. Oh. Oh. But it Thanks. does jack shit, so yeah. cool. Um, awesome. Heimlich? Heimlich, well, tough, if Heimlich, Heimlich toughed it out last time. Right. And Heimlich has is, a Z move. Right? Him, yeah, <sighs> gave us a Z move back. All right, so you want to try the super Z move awesome. move off of Zap Cannon? Yeah, sure, whatever. And see if he can't uh, tough it out. Like I hope else. so. I really hope he does. Nope. Nope. Okay. Cool. All right. Uh, I really call this. I episode. don't care if it's cheating. I want to bring in the big guns. Well, I don't care. I don't anymore. know if they even obey you because yeah. I don't know if you have all your quote unquote badges. I am. We'll call this an episode and we will come back curious. with a new strategy. Thanks yeah. for playing with us, everyone. See you guys next time. Bye.